This is another huge Dollar Tree haul. This is my biggest, largest, most magnificent beauty haul from the Dollar Tree ever. So rate, comment, and subscribe if you love beauty hauls from the Dollar Tree. I got such fabulous, cute, stuff that I can actually use and it's not like I'm putting it in a crafting corner that I'll never get to. It's stuff that you will want to. Still got a wish list but boy have I knocked it out of the park today. My Dollar Tree was good to me this week. Praise the Lord. I also Lord. got these three shampoos from Dollar Tree. Um, actually what I have here is a hydrating shampoo which is a moisturizing shampoo. This is a two-in-one shampoo and conditioner. It is a protein shampoo. And then there is a Pro Formula Damage Repair Shampoo. A lot of people, if you have fine hair, that type of situation, you do need to alternate between a moisturizing shampoo and a protein shampoo. This one right here, I wasn't sure about how it's going to work. It seems to be, to be the same as the um, Damage Repair conditioner oh no that's the con this is a protein conditioner protein shampoo and then a moisturizing shampoo so you alternate between a protein regime and a hydrating regime so i'm gonna give those a try i'll use one of these two and then after i finish those two then i'll have this one and have to get another moisturizer so excited to share because like I've been looking at other people's Dollar Tree hauls and I guess I have a little bit different taste because I have some very unusual, unique stuff. I got great stuff, great, great, great stuff. In my opinion, in my humble opinion, and please comment below and tell me what you think of what I got and if you're looking for it too. But the first thing I wanna show you this is a fly swatter with a sunflower on it, and it's got a green stem. They had a lot of great colors in these, but I just got this one because I like sunflowers. Is that not cute? I mean, you just put it up like that, and it looks like a flower, so you could actually put a fly swatter bouquet, and then you're always ready to get them. So I thought that was so nice. And then they had these cute frames here oh my goodness if you have anybody who's going off to college look at this laugh out loud is that not cute with that purple and that glitter on it and then you hang this up it's just so cute even for a dorm or something like that or you know for teenagers and then i got this one bff and you got the two different ones so you could put your two friends in there and then you have your little thing there oh my goodness do you guys remember when your bff was everything you were plotting to conquer the world together and it's got glitter and these beautiful colors i really like this one for myself because it's got the green and you know, it really looks like flowers okay so let me keep it going i gotta i gotta push forward i got so much you guys know I'm a born again Christian. They had this bell ring for Jesus. <laughs> I love it. I love it. And you know, when you ring for Jesus, Jesus is answering you. That's right. When Jesus takes it seriously, when you call on Jesus, he will answer you. That's the word of God. We don't have to play with that one. So I had to get me a Jesus bell because I call on him and I need to I, I need you, Jesus, right, right now. Can't wait. Look at these for your hair. These just remind me of Hawaii. And what it is, is this top one here is a hair clip. So it just clips on the side. So if you have your style already done, you can put this clip in it on the side. Then the second one is one of those little clamps there. So if you have a ponytail or something, you want to snap that on there. It's perfect for a ponytail. And then, oh. And then this one here, this orange one, is a comb. So no matter what style you have, you can have a nice, beautiful flower. I picked this color set because I thought it was the best summery set. This color here just looks so summer to me. And then, of course, butter yellow and this beautiful hot pink. So I got that. 
you guys. What do you think of this haul so far? Okay, they ha everybody's been hauling these kiss right here. The only color that I don't have that I want is the yellow. I haven't got a good yellow yet for my water mob ruin, and I would like to try these, but this right here is, I don't know, is that, this one is the blue with a purple tinge to it. It is gorgeous. I'm not swatching today. I will do swatch videos later because I have so much makeup in this haul, and I want to get through as much of it as I possibly can. And then I got this neon here. I usually get this kind of color from LA Colors, but I got it from this today. It is brilliant neon. Can you can you see how brilliant that is? I will find out if I need to use a base with that. And then I thought this color was so unique. I love green. Green is one of my favorite colors. And I love frost. So this is right up my alley. And look how good that looks with my skin. I guess that's why I like green. It really goes well with my skin tone. Now let's keep it moving, keep it moving. I got some snacks today, you guys. I usually eat my snacks. I buy them, but I eat them so fast I can't share them. But I've had this one before. This is the mozzarella stick, TJ Fridays. This is the only one that I've tasted. Of. I don't like the potato skins, but I really like these. These taste so good to me. They taste like cheese puffs with a mozzarella flavor instead of a cheddar cheese fragrance. So these mozzarella sticks are really good. And I eat this bag all at one time. So I'm not really saving money. I will devour that, which is why you've never seen the bag before. They had these new pretzels. These are called braided pretzels, and they are honey wheat pretzels. So these are pretzels that have whole wheat in them. So I'm interested to try. Most pretzels are, you know, made with white flour. They don't have any grain in them, but these have whole grain in them. So I'm excited to try them. Who doesn't like honey? And let's see. I have one more food thing I want to share with you. They had this curate harmonious blend. It has almonds, quinoa, apricots, lemon, and honey. That, I mean, there's four bars in here for a dollar and they are so healthy. The number one ingredient is almonds. So this was a score. Now again, I have to admit, I hope I don't, but I could be guilty of eating all four of the bars at one time. But today, I, I came in here and I'm doing this haul before I can eat everything off. Now, Everything else is just 100% makeup. I'm going to do swatches, but not in this video. So if you look, you'll see the swatches because it's just too much to swatch it right now. But anyway, I got this pressed powder here. Look how dark that color is. I am planning on using that as a bronzer to darken up my skin tone. Also, I think I can use this color here, which is Carob. I can use that to darken up my makeup. I don't know how much pigment it has, but I bought the I bought the eyeshadows from this line before, and they are highly pigmented and very easy to use. I love taking these on vacation with me. Now, they had a lot of warm tones. This is such a beautiful conservative palette there. The middle color is a rosy frost. The bottom color is a copper tone and then the top color is this medium taupey brown color that is a matte that is a perfect palette to take on vacation with you just gorgeous this is one of the bronzers i got and the color on that one is biscotti it looks like it might be very close to my own color but it looks like it might have a little bit of like a pink blush tone or red tone in it so then it will work very well for me as a bronzer i also picked up this tawny powder i think this might be my color even if it's a little dark i won't worry about it y'all I'll, I'll wear almost any color if it'll blend in i'll put it on but that's a tawny powder or if it's not my exact color i'll wear it as a bronzer because it's got a lot of life to it i don't normally buy eyeliners but i Everything I've gotten from this particular line, the Beauty Benefits line by Wet n Wild, I've thoroughly enjoyed it. So I figured I'd try this liner out because I think I might like these old-fashioned eyeliners better than the new ones that have come out. So I'm going to keep it moving, keep it moving. And I got this other powder. Maybe this might be my color. If it's not my color now, it's called Oat. It looks like it matches me. So I'll find out if these are translucent powder. Oh, it says Total Coverage Powder. So these total coverage foundation powder, whoa, score. 
Yeah. Okay. And um, let me see what else we got here. And then the rest of these are the eyeshadow kits. Look at those warm colors. This has a peach color, and then it has like a very warm terracotta red color, and then it has this cream color. Again, this is a palette that you could take on vacation with you. I'm going to swatch these all later. And let me see. This one is called Classic. And then I got Evening, which is just a little bit different. It just has a darker brown in it. Still has a terracotta color in it, but I think this terracotta color might be a frost. And then it has a peachy nude color for your brow bone there. So I think these two are interchangeable, but if you're darker, this color here might not show up on you, but all of these red tones will show up on most dark skinned people. And we're getting to the end of it. I'm trying so hard for you. Oh, I got another bronzer. I thought this might, again, I thought this might be my color or it might be a very, very light bronzy tone for me, you know, just to, if, if it contrasts my skin, because I think I see a lot of red in there, and so that could contrast to be a nice bronzer. Either way, I'm happy with it. I love this line. And then I got this one, which is, it seems they're browns, but these browns have a rosy hue to them. As you can see very clearly in the lightest color there, it is quite rosy. And then this color here is more of a coffee, cafe coffee color. And then finally, this brown here, you might not be able to pick it up, but it has a lot of rose tones in it. So this is a rose tone brown palette, which is amazing to get all of that for just a dollar a piece. I didn't pick this one up because as you can see, I already have it. I have one of these that I'm using. If you see this color and you like colorful palettes, I highly recommend this for the summer. You will see me wearing this palette for the summer. This is what I want to take when I go on vacation. I like to take this one. I didn't see a palette that I, this, this palette they do have in the new packaging. This palette I did not see, but if you do see this palette here, it has a beautiful golden frost color here. Then it comes with a matte, very, very dark brown. And then it comes with a nice brow bone color. This is good to take on vacation with you because this brown here is dark enough to be my eyebrow color. And then I just put the gold on the lid and this one up above it. And I'm good. I can do whatever I want to. I can contour with this color. I can highlight with this color. You know, this is a really good palette. But I didn't see this particular palette. But if you do in your store see, um, it was 34399. I don't know if they put those kind of numbers on these this time. No, they put names on them this time. But they're the same palettes. But if you run into one with a gold at the bottom, dark brown in the middle, and a vanilla cream at the top this color the, this palette is really really good if you can find it i have another one these are my backups so that's everything that i got in this dollar tree haul just amazing amazing stuff i will have swatches for you so just look for them did i tell you you're beautiful <laughs>